Hello and welcome to my channel. I hope you enjoy the story. I'm going to try and upload a new story each day. The Cryptic Shadows of Moonlit Marsh Once, a forgotten corner of the world, nestled deep within the embrace of ancient trees and shrouded in an eerie mist, lay the Moonlit Marsh. It was a place whispered about in hushed tones, a place where shadows took on a life of their own, and the echoes of forgotten secrets lingered in the air. A group of adventurous campers, drawn to the allure of the mysterious marsh, decided to set up their camp near its murky waters, unaware of the horrors that awaited them as the moon cast its pale glow upon the landscape. The evening began like any other camping trip. The campfire crackled, casting dancing shadows on the faces of the eager campers. Stories were shared, laughter echoed through the stillness, and the warmth of the fire momentarily dispelled the chill in the air. However, as the last timbers flickered and the moon ascended to its throne in the ink-black sky, the marsh below stood with an unsettling energy. The air thickened, and the once muted sounds of the night amplified. Unseen creatures rustled in the underbrush, and strange whispers slithered through the tall grass. The group, now huddled together, felt an unspoken tension permeate the atmosphere. As the first shadowy figures emerged from the depths of the marsh, their ghastly forms seemed to defy the natural order of the world. Each figure bore the semblance of a human, yet their features were obscured by an otherworldly darkness. The campers, frozen in terror, watched as the figures glided toward them, their movements synchronized with an eerie grace. The marsh, once a place of mysterious beauty, now exuded an aura of malevolence. As the figures drew closer, the campers began to discern haunting whispers, each voice revealing a dark secret from their past. One figure, a silhouette with hollow eyes, whispered tales of betrayal and deceit. Another, with outstretched arms that seemed to merge with the shadows, spoke of a lost love that turned to vengeful hatred. The air pulsed with the weight of remorse, and the marsh seemed to absorb the pain of these tormented spirits. One by one, the campers became ensnared in the clutches of the shadows, their own past sins illuminated in the moonlit night. The marsh, once a passive observer, became an accomplice in the revelation of long-buried secrets. Desperation filled the air as the campers struggled to break free from the grip of the shadows, but the more they resisted, the tighter the spectral noose became. As the night wore on, the marsh echoed with the anguished cries of those ensnared in the cryptic shadows. The campfire, now reduced to a feeble glow, illuminated the twisted expressions of the tormented souls. The marsh, having absorbed the pain and suffering of the past, seemed to pulse with an unnatural energy. At dawn, the shadows receded, retreating into the depths of the marsh, leaving behind a campsite shrouded in an eerie silence. The campers, released from the clutches of the otherworldly figures, found themselves changed, haunted by the knowledge of the shadows that lurked within their own souls. The moonlit marsh, forever marked by the cryptic shadows, stood as a testament to the lingering secrets that can surface when the moonlight unveils the hidden darkness within. The once innocent campsite now bore witness to the profound and harrowing experiences of those who dared to camp near the ancient waters, forever etching their stories into the fabric of the haunted marshland. In the wake of that fateful night, the moonlit marsh acquired an even darker reputation. Locals, who had long avoided the area, spoke of the cursed ground and the tormented spirits that wandered the marsh under the moon's watchful gaze. The legend of the cryptic shadow spread like wildfire, dissuading even the most intrepid souls from venturing near. Yet the campers who had survived that haunting night couldn't shake the haunting memories that clung to them like a relentless fog. They returned to their normal lives, haunted by the shadows that had unraveled their darkest secrets. The group, once bound by the camaraderie of adventure, now drifted apart, forever marked by the unearthly encounter at the moonlit marsh. Each survivor found themselves compelled to revisit the memories of that night, plagued by vivid nightmares that replayed the whispers of the shadows. The secrets laid bare by the cryptic figures haunted their waking hours, casting long shadows across their lives. Relationships crumbled, careers faltered, and a pervasive sense of doom hung over them like a heavy shroud. Driven by an inexplicable force, the survivors felt compelled to return to the moonlit marsh, drawn back to the place that had unraveled the fabric of their existence. As the group reunited on the edge of the marsh, they discovered that the shadows had not forgotten them. 
The spectral figures, though dormant during daylight, lingered just beyond the veil of reality, waiting for the sun to dip below the horizon. As night fell once again, the shadows emerged with a renewed malevolence. The whispers intensified, weaving a tapestry of regret, guilt, and sorrow that ensnared the campers in its web. The marsh, now a stage for the unfolding tragedy, seemed to pulse with an ancient power as the figures danced through the moonlit mist. Desperation set in as the survivors grappled with the relentless onslaught of the shadows. Memories resurfaced, betrayals were laid bare, and the once close friends found themselves entangled in a nightmarish ballet with the spectral entities. The marsh itself seemed to come alive, its murky waters reflecting the twisted faces of the tormented spirits. In a desperate bid to break free from the grip of the shadows, the survivors sought answers within the heart of the marsh. Added by an otherworldly force, they navigated through the thickets and treacherous terrain, each step bringing them closer to the epicenter of the haunting. As they reached the center of the moonlit marsh, an ancient crypt emerged from the mist. The air crackled with an eerie energy as the survivors, faces etched with fear, entered the crypt. Within its damp and dimly lit chambers, they discovered the source of the cryptic shadows, a relic of an age long forgotten. A cursed artifact, hidden within the depths of the crypt, held the key to the torment that had befallen the moonlit marsh. The survivors, driven by a mix of fear and determination, sought to destroy the accursed object, hoping to sever the connection between the shadows and the marsh. However, the shadows fought back with a ferocity that matched the depths of their anguish. The crypt echoed with anguish cries as the survivors battled not only the spectral figures but also the malevolent energy that emanated from the cursed artifact. The air itself seemed to thicken with the weight of centuries-old suffering. As the survivors struggled against the relentless onslaught, a figure emerged from the shadows a ghostly apparition, neither entirely malevolent nor benevolent. The spirit revealed itself to be the guardian of the marsh, cursed to wander for eternity, its own tragic tale woven into the fabric of the moonlit marsh. In a moment of clarity, the guardian implored the survivors to break the cycle of suffering by destroying the cursed artifact. With newfound resolve, the group pressed on, channeling their collective strength to overcome the malevolent forces that sought to keep them ensnared. As the artifact shattered, a blinding light enveloped the crypt, dispelling the shadows that had haunted the marsh for centuries. The spectral figures, released from their torment, dissipated into the night, leaving behind a calm and hauntingly beautiful landscape. The survivors, exhausted and forever changed, emerged from the crypt, now free from the clutches of the cryptic shadows. The guardian, his ethereal form fading, offered a solemn farewell, its ancient curse finally lifted. As dawn broke over the moonlit marsh, the survivors gazed upon the transformed landscape. The marsh, once an excess of suffering, now exuded an eerie tranquility. The whispers of the past were replaced by the rustling of leaves and the soft hum of the wind through the ancient trees. The survivors, forever bound by the shared ordeal, left the moonlit marsh behind, carrying with them the scars of the cryptic shadows. The legend of their harrowing encounter persisted, a cautionary tale for those who dared to tread near the marsh's haunted waters. The moonlit marsh, having cast off the shackles of its dark history, stood as a testament to the enduring power of redemption and the resilience of the human spirit in the face of otherworldly horrors. Thank you for listening, I hope you enjoyed the story. Please don't forget to like and even better like and subscribe. Thank you very much, have a great day.